this year's Geneva Motor Show is actually the 83rd edition and 750,000 people will have walked through its doors over the last few days. the Geneva Motor Show 2013 with FRL Motoring News. It's an absolutely busy day as usual here. And we thought we'd start off here with a Lamborghini 750-4. What a cracker. stand with the Aventador LP700-4, a top speed of 217 miles per hour and that magical 0-62 to miles per hour figure of just 2.9 seconds. Now that's motorbike competition. motoring show and we're here to talk to you about all the wonderful cars that are coming to Britain in 2013. This is one of them, the brand new Bentley Flying Spur. Bentley actually offers you a bespoke choice so you could go for a purple interior, a cream interior, different woods, different metals, different stitching. Really, if you've got the money, the world is your oyster when it comes to Bentley. And of course, this car isn't just about looks inside, it's about its wonderful exterior beauty too, and of course the performance. This car will do 200 miles per hour. It'll also do 0-62 magical dash in 4.6 seconds. Fuel consumption is never going to be brilliant on a car like this, but you're never going to buy it for that reason. The combined fuel consumption of this brand new Bentley is just 19.2 to the gallon. But it's made up really in some ways by the boot. 475 litres of huge amounts of space there. <laughs> Porsche have the GT3 911 road going version here, but it isn't just a road going version, you've got a track button as well. So if you feel the need to hit the Nürburgring, this will do very nicely indeed. This car is absolutely beautiful. I don't need to say any more, the camera says it all. So alongside its new 911 Carrera 4 and KNS diesel, Porsche has taken the opportunity to unveil its vision of the sports car of tomorrow at the Geneva Motor Show. It's a hybrid four-door car with the elegant and luxurious lines that Porsche is known for. With a maximum power of 416 horsepower, going from 0 to 62 miles per hour in under six seconds, the hybrid can even go without the use of its heat engine, and you can even monitor and manage the car via a dedicated smartphone app. This elegant car that you can even take your family in is going to surprise all of us with its amazing performance. With a 616 horsepower W12 engine capable of literally catapulting it to a top speed of 200 miles per hour, there's never been a mass produced Bentley with such power and performance as the Bentley Continental GT Speed. Well, Lexus is always a car that's associated with pure luxury. Perhaps not as ostentatious as some of the more German luxury brands, but this particular car here, the Lexus GS 450H, is a hybrid, and this car is a hybrid with huge amounts of power. For instance, this will be 0 to 62 miles per hour in just 5.9 seconds. It's pretty amazing considering it's meant to be a green car. Do you prefer the coupe or roaster version of the 370Z? Well, whichever, it returns with a new look for 2013. With a V6 engine, rear-wheel drive and legendary style, this high-powered car is back to grip the road. It 
its new SRC system and automatic heel and toe system to adjust the engine speed when shifting gears makes this total package simply amazing. Well, of course, Toyota Racing Development has been designing custom parts for race cars for over half a century. And their race car aerodynamics and high performance can now be found in Europe at the wheel of this, the GT86. We're talking about the Range Rover Autobiography 5 litre turbo. Range Rover's latest luxury SUV is both imposing and light. With its aluminium monocot structure, it's 39% lighter than that of its forerunner. And a real technical feat, weighing 420 kilograms less, it's both the archetypal luxury Range Rover and a totally reinvented king of the road. <laughs> Even on the road, you can still travel first and business class with this wonderful car that boasts luxury and performance. Dedicated to all those who want to combine business with pleasure, this has the fastest acceleration of any hybrid saloon and even features in the Guinness Book of Records. The only problem is, with its heated, ventilated seats, voice recognition, sat-nav system and Bose sound system with 10 speakers, it's hard to find a good reason to get out of it. This is, quite simply, the fastest electric car in the world, and proof of what is now technically possible to accomplish with electric propulsion. This super sporty car, whose performance and silver arrows entered the realm of automobile legend many years ago, is a worthy descendant. It emits no exhaust gases and includes cutting-edge Formula One technology. This ultra-high performance car by AMG is also the most powerful electric car ever, with four electric engines providing a total of power of 552 kilowatts. It's not hard to see how it's able to go from 0 to 62 in 3.9 seconds. This successful tribute to the 20s with handmade interiors and elegantly simple two-tone bodywork conjures up the essence of the world's most luxurious car brand, still embodied today by its mascot, the Spirit of Ecstasy.
course, the Geneva Motor Show allows exhibitors and third parties to come and present or discuss subjects of interest to professionals and amateurs in the motor sector. But equally, it's a place to show off what the producers have got on offer now, but also amazing concepts, including the increasingly popular electric vehicles. BMW is already setting out the blueprint for premium compacts with this 190 horsepower hybrid concept, which has a spacious interior and lines in keeping with the brand's DNA. It shows how to merge a sports car and electric vehicle in one car, with plenty of space for the driver and their passengers, and a modular luggage compartment overhead. You can charge his battery from a conventional electric socket. The BMW Concept Active Tour. The Peugeot Onyx, a worthy descendant of the Le Mans race cars with over 200 years of car design behind it. This supercar concept may well be a blueprint for the vehicles of tomorrow. Its bodywork, handmade by a master craftsman, is polished like a mirror and will look even more refined over time. Its wings and doors, made from pure copper leaf, while the other panels are made of carbon as its central structure, which contains a 600 horsepower V8 engine. One of the mixed results of the motor industry around the world in 2012, the Geneva International Motor Show is always a place to be seen. For all the exhibitors and manufacturers, Geneva remains the primary annual and unmissable exhibition for leaders and bosses who like to get together on the acclaimed press days and of course, all the people who like to come and visit across the days after that.